how can we get companies to think not just about short-term financial metrics, daily stock price, quarterly earnings, right? Trying to drive those profit numbers down to the penny. How can we get them to focus on the longer term and on the bigger picture? There's not a better place to start than with Peter Drucker's work. It has been one of the great honors of my 10 years at the Drucker Institute to have been able to work together with the Wall Street Journal on the Management Top 250 special section. We have a number of different audiences. The first is just the general public. We want to reintroduce them to these timeless principles that Peter Drucker laid out over his six plus decades of writing about management in a way that's easy to access and understand, systematic, transparent, reliable, and available year after year. We have developed a statistical model that evaluates five dimensions of corporate performance, customer satisfaction, employee engagement and development, innovation, social responsibility, and financial strength. Perhaps it gets used as one tool among many for executive compensation or a way for boards to monitor their long-term performance. We also think this is gonna be a powerful tool for investors. If companies are gonna digest Drucker's principles today, we need hard metrics to catch the attention of executives and investors. That's the world we live in. It means covering the companies and the executive activities that are going on today, even if they mirror perfectly what Peter Drucker had to say about Sears Roebuck in the 1940s, uh, we need to understand exactly what's happening today on today's terms. And our company rankings are a crucial way of doing that.